most of you guys already know, I did just get a bunch of stuff from NRG. I just opened my seat brackets, so we should be able to get everything in today. I'm just gonna open this car all up, uh, just so I have easy access to the seats and everything. I'm gonna go ahead and take the top off. I just started it, it hasn't been started in about a week. How do people leave their cars like this? Look at this, f***ing peanuts in here. And these like jelly bean things. This is, I mean, this is probably useful. Uh, if you need that, but it doesn't need that. Oh, what the f***? This guy had some like nut fetish or some shit. This is disgusting. I'm gonna need to grab some gloves. So bad. Disgusting. as I can yeah. without like being retarded about it. All right, well, let's see how this works. After much fiddling around, we found out that we had to add some uh, the, the holes on the main brackets, we'll show you with the passenger seat, but the holes on this didn't match up with the brackets on this one. Obviously, these are eBay brackets, but the weird thing is that these brackets do come with NRG seats that are on eBay, so I don't really know what's going on there, but uh, it doesn't really matter because now that I added this uh, seat slider, which I'll put a link in the description on where I got this as well, um, because you are going to need it unless you want to modify this bracket. Um, and then it also makes me a little bit taller as well. You saw that we had to add the spacers to the front and that's just to get a little bit more angle as you see. Uh, I'm bottom one here, top one there, and that's just to get as much angle as possible. Uh, as you see, when I even put it in there now, I'm sure it'll still be a little bit more forward than I usually like to sit, but I also like to sit like a bum. So um, everything's tightened up. This one should be good. We'll throw this in there, see how it fits. Should be good. So, I'm actually pretty comfortable. You are? Yeah. I think throw the other one in there, put everything together, uh, steering wheel, harness bar, harnesses, and we'll see how comfortable I am. If I want to uh, be a little bit more tilted, then I'll adjust it. But as of right now, I feel pretty comfortable. We'll see once I get the steering wheel in, see how close that is. Alrighty, let's move on to the passenger seat. Looks good so far though. Really liking these seats, especially this model where it has this like a uh, swoop here kind of matches the stock seat style more than this one where like a lot of people have this kind of square I think that it's definitely good choice on my end so first thing I did get more angle it's so obviously move oh, damn it 
I think that was it. Yeah. Anyway, let's move this both sides down to the bottom one. This one's already at the top. So it's about as much adjustment as you get there. Alrighty. And then as you can see here, uh, these holes, neither of these holes match up with the holes on here. So uh, if you plan to mount this to this, that's gonna be a problem. And I had checked, there's no way, even if you put these holes and if you redrilled this to the forward most holes, I think, uh, it's you're still like on top of the steering wheel even more than I was uh, before. So adding this definitely helps. You sit a little bit higher. I don't really like sitting too low. I know a lot of people like to sit real low. That one was sitting a little low for me, but uh, with these, I think I'll be a little bit more comfortable than that other seat. So I'll go ahead, like I said, I'll put a link in the description to where I got these as well, just because uh, if you guys need to get these, uh, I, you know that this way these will fit for sure. Uh, they fit right up for me, all the holes match. And you see here, this kit, you know, comes with all these bolts and everything. And it comes with the hardware you need to bolt up this entire thing. And then you uh, get these little spacers, so that way uh, you can space out between here and this bracket, uh, just so that has room to move. Obviously goes in there. And then you just put it straight down there. Let's move on. I want to do the steering wheel. I feel like doing the steering wheel. Good thing my battery's dead. Why? So the oh, oh airbag it still might blow up in it my face. It can still go off. It doesn't take a lot to set them off. All right, Debbie Downer. I just want to put my steering wheel in. Thanks, so. Oh my god. That's so bad. I didn't know it was that bad. Oh my god. I could have died. What do you have? This. First of all, I got this sweet little gadget so I can see what the f I'm doing. There we go. Do I want to go this way? You want to yeah. push towards me. Why did it just slip? Okay, are you sure it's an Allen key? I don't know what it is. I looked online and it was that f***ing stupid key uh, shit. Let me look at this shit, alright? Let me look at the other side. Maybe it, someone it, didn't it, f*** this shit up. No, it's- dude, that one's so rounded out, that's why. It's a rounding on? Dude, I was right with that original shit. Just that other one is fucked. Did you probably have fucked it? No, it wasn't me. That's what we get. We have it on videotape. Dude, I really, I didn't fuck nothing up. It was like that. Watch, this one will come off. Just fine. Loose. I'm telling you. Wasn't me. Alright, so now you gotta drill out your fucking steering wheel. I guess. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Woo. Didn't blow up. The lone touch. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Long Let's see. So, 
what happens is this mounts to these mounts here and then these mount from here and they go down to here and that's what kind of creates that you know structure wow look at that pristine it's, it's just been covering up the beauty of the car dude i don't really consider that beauty it's kind of disgusting actually sick hands have so much fucking dust on them. Like dust is like, the consistency is just awful. Yeah, that, that just looks really nasty down there. Oh yeah, and it's a little wet too. Ugh. Okay. Yeah, you wanna feel it? No, it does. <laughs> Negative. Even then, there's it's no way that this is getting down to there. The come down like, fall. Yeah, what I'd do is I'd cut this, cut this, I'd sleeve it, you know, I'd get a, a piece of pipe that's bigger than this, yeah. I'd weld it there, and then obviously I'd bend it. I think that's what's gonna have to happen. Yeah, this is gonna be awesome. I'm pretty psyched. Looks pretty good. Feels pretty good. I'd like to drive it. I mean, both the seat and in the could. I don't have any seat belts. I'll do that harness bar. It shouldn't take too much. Honestly, I think it'll actually be a pretty quick process. But I'm pretty excited. The steering wheel feels good. Nice uh, suede or Alcantara, or whatever they call it. But. That's it for today. I'll put all the links in the description of all the parts, all these different NRG stuff, uh, the seat slides that I had to use. Um, and if you want to check them out, check them out. Anyways, I'll see you in the next couple of days for another video. Peace out.